and say hi to Prada. I've been so stressed that like it has just not let any excitement in. Mm. Oh. I'm a YouTuber for real now. Okay, y'all. Y'all see how we come in. Pop my eyeball? Am I gonna be okay? Leaving to Paris tomorrow? You're panicking. I'm not panicking. No napkin. That's fake. when I was gonna start this vlog so let me go ahead and just kick it off right now so that I can just be for real like I always am in my vlogs with y'all let me pause this because I'm watching some Dubai vlogs right now so today is Sunday uh, November 13th we're like one week post birthday but we about to re-celebrate our birthday all over again um, so I'm going to Paris and Dubai um, I am leaving on Tuesday, so two days away, and all week I have been working like probably like 70 to 75 hours this week, so literally like Friday I worked 12 to 1 and then went and bartended from like 1 to 5, came back and worked 12 to 1 the next day. I was supposed to work today, but I called in, but let's get into like what's real, so basically and all that what I'm saying is I have done absolutely not a damn thing to prepare to this trip because I just like had my birthday and then I was like working like that's the only thing I've done to prepare to this trip is like work 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 so I have like a little to-do list going the things that I'm currently working on is trying to use everything in my fridge so I just made like a crazy breakfast sandwich um, with all these ingredients <clears throat> and also I'm trying to like prepare my health so I have this green drink. I literally love it. Uh, is this um, apple, celery, cucumber, kale, and greens? It actually tastes really good. Like the apple really just comes through, and I squeeze a fresh lemon in it too. Um, and I'm making some tea. And then I'm gonna take my vitamins. So I'm really trying to like get <clears throat> my body ready. Um, let's talk about my. Oh wait, here's a little piece of my breakfast. I don't know why my camera is doing me like this. Doing me in, boy. Okay, so I need to go to Target, get a new memory card, some conditioner, cat litter, cat food, and this kitty couch. This is just a list I just came up with, so the list is actually much longer, but I have to finish this flyer, do some edits for this fart spray vlog, um, record top 10 tips to be a server, start this vlog that I'm doing right now, check, and then we're not gonna talk about that, but um, OnlyFans pop in. Um, I need to book my Airbnb still and pack, and then I need to clean. Those are like a few things that I want to get done today. So, um, also like I need to get my lashes done, I need to get my hair did, okay? And the packing thing is I'm worried about because I'm like nervous as to what I can wear. As of right now, my understanding is like covering shoulders to knees, um, because I'm not about to go over there and play any type of game, so... I'm gonna have to like dig deep in my closet. So yeah, um, that's where I'm at right now, completely unprepared, and welcome to the vlog. And say hi to Prada. Okay. Um yeah, so I guess I'll just like keep y'all updated as anything happens, but this is part one, preparing to go to Dubai and Paris. Next day. Today is November 14th. And. Okay, my sister wants to say hi to them. Sorry, I'm not together. Come on, guys. It's snowing outside. Better so down. Show them. Okay. There's snow out there. Wow. Okay, anyways, I'm going to go get cute today. I'm going to get my lashes and my makeup done. I mean, my lashes and my hair done. Leaving to Paris tomorrow. Tonight, I have a birthday dinner for the girl I'm going to Dubai with. Okay, talk to you later. Bye. Tell me why I'm 
why the only thing that got my car back right after my last vlog if you haven't seen it check it out this literally was the only thing like it's been a week and my car still is like just now getting normal smell back again i tried everything but i'm getting gas and i got these trina wrap snacks i usually get the little baby ones but they only have the bad little baby ones and this what are your favorite gas station snacks drop below still on the phone with the sister so disappointed because they are cheese puffs. Ah. We are halfway and I'm going to get my lashes done. <laughs> Where's Estio? And I get the baby. Baby, yay. So we put one pack in my hair and then I had to go to my lash appointment. So I'm gonna go back after. But my lash tech just told me she's running 10 minutes late because she had to pick her daughter up from school. So I'm stopping at Dairy Queen and going to get me a little mini guy. It's crazy. Can y'all believe I never liked ice cream before because my teeth are so sensitive to the cold and like my brain freezes so bad um, that it literally just was never an enjoyable like thing for me. But anyways, like what is the secret Dairy Queen menu because... I feel like what I'd be getting is super basic. What is the mini size called? Hi, I'm from Dairy Queen. May I take your order, please? Hi, can I have like the mini blizzard? Mini, what kind of blizzard, ma'am? Um, can I have cookie dough and Oreo? Actually, can I have the cinnamon roll center and Oreo? Oh, cinnamon center, we are off it right now, ma'am. Okay, I'll just do the cookie dough and Oreo then. Oh, just cookie dough? Yes, please. All right, thank you. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. And my lash check. She is like an hour away from me, and I always drive to see her because y'all are about to see why. Y'all are about to see why. So I need to go to the bank, finish getting my hair done, run to the store, to Target to grab a couple things, and then I need to go home and like put stuff in my suitcase, actually pack, get ready for this dinner tonight at Fogo, which I'm super excited for, and see if they're gonna go out. If not, tomorrow I'm going to Paris, y'all. I'm literally going to Paris tomorrow in Dubai after that. like I'm like starting to like get like excited a little bit, but I've been so stressed that like it has just not let any excitement in, I swear to you. But this is such a cool experience and I literally have like no expectations. I don't know what it's gonna be like. I'm like low key like dreading all of these. Like I'm gonna be spending 40 hours, <laughs> 40 hours on a plane, like four days of travel. Like I literally have to fly to Paris to get to Dubai. You have to like fly to Paris or you have to fly to like, um, Amsterdam like you basically have to fly to Europe to get to Dubai which is ridiculous because it's literally like 10 hours and 10 hours like there's got to be a better way we got to do better okay but let's see what this is hitting for and I whoop and I whoop and it's 2.32 thank you thank you mm-hmm love you too Arnold I don't know how they got my phone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you too. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Take care. Bye-bye. Y'all. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Next time y'all see me, I'm going to be long last shorty. Big blink baby. Okay? Look, look at her, her uh, period okay um so now i need to go finish getting my hair done i need to run to target still and i'm honestly at the line of taco bell and uh, what do you get from taco bell comment below i don't want to hear none of that taco bell is trash i know i know i know but everybody has guilty pleasure and also there's not that much fast food in atlanta that like i can't get down with like this southern fast food i don't know why but i just can't um and i haven't really explored this menu like that it's what i've seen so i'm probably gonna get like a chalupa 
or what is the one that's like hard shell with the soft shell around it? I'm gonna get one of those. Crunchy gordita? I don't know. Um, but yeah, just something to hold me over until dinner. I have dinner at 7 o'clock. It's 5.30. My hair is not finished. I don't know what I'm gonna wear. I need to go, these br bro. I need to go to the nail shop and get my brows done. Um, and also my hairstylist is going through a, she finding where her man's, so she's not picking up the phone. And I looked at location, I know she's at her man's house, so I'm like, um, so yeah, uh, wish me luck to pull this all together. Hi, this what- is for me. At the moment, I don't have, mine has a for the moment. And it's what we talk about. That's okay. It's that stage of heart. Okay. Um, Ken, what is the type of taco that has hard shell on the outside and then the soft one around it? It's a uh, cheese gordita part. Yes, can I have one of those, but with the Doritos Locos taco? Please don't give me up. Um, can you just make make it a supreme? We want to add soccer myself. Yeah. Hi, that's all where you're supposed to want to put me on my six, fifteen. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Since when is Taco Bell six fifteen for one goddamn taco? No, we bought some. Yum yum yum. Let me tell you, bitch, what a boss do. Never let a nigga double cross you. Always let him know you got the sauce too. Boss move. Okay, I am truly in a rush, but I already spilled. So like, y'all, they need to get their shit together. They were taking so long that the person in front of me left. But since we're doing a little mukbang, let's talk about this. And this isn't about my um like lash or nail tech. But in general, like, how come if we are running late, it's a fee and the world is ending? But you ever showed up for an appointment and they're with the client before you still? And that that's okay. That's perfectly fine. Like, how come we don't get money off our service? Okay, y'all. Oh my god. Mystery meat bussin'. For real. One weird thing about Atlanta the Target and the Walmarts never have live people. They only, only have self checkout, literally. Only. Only. Yeah. Targets here suck. There's no super target. Like, you can not go grocery shopping at Target here. Um, that defeats the purpose of Target. Target. Target's supposed to be a one stop shop. Shorty gave me three packets. Like, I need a whole packet per bite. I can't even make three stretch. Alright. How the fuck? I'm about to be squeezing the old ones again. Like. Uh, mm. Um. They talk about they only got mild. No hot. No fire. No nothing. Y'all, I don't know how I'm about to do this flight. Eight hours? Ten hours? Four times? How? Like, I'm about to find God, Jesus, the Josiah, all of them. I'm about to get in touch with everybody on that much of a flight, like. That sounds like an acid trip, like. That shit not gonna even feel right. Wow. And no napkins. That was crazy. <laughs> Taking forever, all right. No sauces? 
Because of the sauce, you did give me only three of them? <laughs> All right. No napkins? That was crazy. But, all right. I am running to the bank. Target. Home. I'm going to try to get most of that done. Now, I need to be home by 6 o'clock. It's 5.30, so I'm probably just going to run to Target. Um, and use the ATM downstairs so I can be quick. Um, it's literally 5.30 and I'm just now making it over back to Buckhead by my house. So I'm like literally picking and choosing what tasks I'm going to be able to get done. So I'm pulling up to the nail shop first, going to get my eyebrows done, and then I'm going to run to the mall and try to grab her a gift really quick. And that's all I'm going to be able to accomplish today before getting ready. Like, I'll be lucky it's 5.30 if I can get home by 6.30 and get ready in 15, 20 minutes. That's the plan. So 5.30. Hopefully I'm out of the nail shop by 5.45 out of the mall by 6.15 and then can get ready from 6.15 to 6.30. Uh, something like that, it's unrealistic, but everything's really close, so wish me luck. Really 5.48, we are at Lennox and she's played my brows. I'm gonna get her a real quick gifty gift, like literally in and out in 10, 15 minutes. I'm just gonna grab her like some cute perfume or something like that. Just made it home. It's 626, so I'm going to get ready quick. Tap back in in a second once I'm ready. I have no idea. And it's currently 721, so we're going out. We're gonna switch to the phone. The next day. So vlogging but I literally just rolled out of bed I did not stay out late last night Kendall came over and we're gonna finish doing my hair to start the day I think we're gonna smoke some weed first to start the day actually okay y'all y'all see how we come in we got tapes in Oh, we supposed to come in here? Oh my goodness. It's giving a volume. Perfect curls. A blend A1. I love it. I'll train. <laughs> I don't know how to stop recording. You can just push the. Oh, duh. Farah. Farah. Why oh, you got so much to say? Spicy, that's a spicy girl. Why she? Just got back from the last, hopefully, of my errands. Had to protect the hair with a hoodie and a hat, but. Let me show y'all what I got. Getting ready for Paris and Dubai. Target haul. Real quick. Okay. Ever need to be this gloomy out? Like, that's crazy. That's crazy. I got cat litter. I got cat litter um, so I can do a fresh litter box. Um, so half of the snacks are for the um, <clears throat> on the plane, and then half of them are for later. So I'm gonna start with the on the plane snacks. I got sour ropes and sour patch kids. These are for my friend because she said she wanted some gummies and some hot chips. But she will have to put these in her bag because these are big as hell. Or you might have to like open them just to get some air out because that is not gonna fit in whose bag. I got some pistachios just to like give me something to do on the plane. Salt and pepper, peanut butter, chocolate, trail mix. Got some peppered beef jerky, pretzel, classic pretzel hummus, Pringles. Once you pop, you can't stop. And this is these salt. I got two Lunchables. Fuck. All right. To life I'm back to eating pork I guess I forgot that has pork in it and then a turkey and cheddar one I'm gonna split these up like half and half half for the plane and then half for um, I think that's about it for the plane 
And I got these. <laughs> I might put one of these in my bag for the plane, but mainly for the house. And then I got two of these little like, sear oh, these are for the plane too. Yeah, I like the clumps one better, but I couldn't find it since I was at Target. Um, I got two of these little pancake instant things, maybe just for like a quick snack at the Airbnb. Pack of gum. Drop, comment below, what is your favorite gum? Um, these blue raspberry, I've been seeing all the TikTok girlies have them and I'm a caffeine addict, so I'm excited about that. Um, pancake tea. Oh, I got these Velveeta things for the, if I bring one, do you think the flight attendant will put in the microwave for me? Like. They will, right? I might bring one on the plane and see if they go for it. And then uh, a mini conditioner. Um, this little mini hair thing. Uh, shower cap. Okay, I got two of these little like immune super shots. Okay, I got two of these little immune super shots. The sheer thing, cause like just in case I am wearing something that shows my legs, I figured this would maybe help a little bit. Um, mini gel and a brown liner so I can meet my husband. Um, so that's it from Target. And my Target trip cost or 90 40 after tax. And then I went to Petco and I got um, some cat food and this cat couch. My cats fucking love it, but it's so dirty. So I'm like, I'm only gonna put it out when I'm like on vacation. Uh, my pet co is $45 just for that. And the last bed is cat food. And I stopped and got Zaxby's for the first time. And I did a review on my TikTok, so check it out. But it's time to pack. I'm a YouTuber for real now, okay? Go ahead and subscribe with the bell because I'm dropping content. We're doing Vlogmas. We're doing so many Dubai videos, okay? Like when I was researching Dubai, I really like was having a hard time finding a video that I could truly relate to because it was like, to be honest, like I didn't see a lot of people traveling from the US and I feel like just the cultural difference, like the cultural shock was a little different like from a person from the UK going to Dubai versus an American going to the Dubai. Uh, welcome to my life. Uh, shout out to Kendall for getting my hair right and I will hit you guys up in a little bit. I'm gonna go try to pack. It is currently 3 o'clock, so 10, 9, 8, 7 hours from my flight, like 5 hours from when I need to go to the airport, and when I tell y'all, a bitch ain't packed a, a nan damn thing, like, a bitch has not packed a fucking damn thing! So it's three o'clock, I mean, yeah, three. I'm giving myself from three to four to pack. Fill this baby up. Okay, 3.30 update. We have this side packed with all my clothes, just a few like sweatsuits, and then this side is gonna be like all my makeup and shoes and accessories, so, phew. My goal is to be done packing by four o'clock and then start cleaning for an hour. Four, five, six, seven, I have like three hours. One hour packing, one hour cleaning, one hour work. Okay, five o'clock update. Um, we basically completely packed this and decided we are gonna bring this. I finished the litter box and now I'm about to close the suitcase and then take a shower. I need a little break from packing. Are you panicking yet? Or am I panicking? You're panicking, I'm not panicking. Okay, and now I'm going to attempt to use this little like scale thing um, to weigh my suitcase. And mind you, I have never used this before. Okay. Let's see. Zero pounds. It's overweight, you guys. It's 50.88, fuck. This is heavy, let me see exactly how heavy it is. Oh. Okay, try again. Ah! I just stabbed myself in the eye with 51 pounds of weight with a nail with my eye open. Like, did I pop my eyeball? Am I gonna be okay? That cannot be good. Literally just cannot. There's no way. 
We're just gonna pretend like we're fine. I cannot tell. This shit weighs too much. How about that? Turn it sideways. Alright, it's 54 pounds. So, we're gonna take a shower and close my eye for a second. And then I uh, will be back to rearrange those. We got out of the shower. It's 5 30. I finished like packing what I need to pack into here. The only thing I have left to pack is my shoes, and then I have to transfer. I can't remember if I said four or eight pounds. Um, what are your guys' go to things? Like, overlooking this, like, what do you think that I should move? Like, <sighs> fuck. Wish me luck. I literally only moved these shoes and this bag, which is full of all my other purses, so it's pretty heavy. Um, and that has to be enough because nothing else can really go. Because I still have to fit these couple pairs of shoes into there. <sighs> I'm officially starting to panic because it's 5:45. So let's go for weigh-in number two. Weigh-in number two. What is you? Okay, we're at like 48. 48 pounds. Smooth. Now we just gotta fit the rest of my stuff into here, which there is just a couple pairs of shoes that I gotta fit in this little hole right here. Wish me luck. Your girl is literally packed. Two suitcases, check bag, carry on. Now it's like my backpack pretty much is like spacious just for like this extra little small stuff. However, my problem is, is I literally have this bag full of food like literally this entire thing is snacks like the snackage is running over like are they gonna let me bring on my carry-on a backpack and this fucking purse like luckily when I come back I'll have less snacks but Sheesh. Now that I am officially done packing, I'm going to try to get through a few more things on my to-do list. It's currently six o'clock, so I have like another hour. Like from six to seven, I'm supposed to be working, but I'm gonna like, you know, do what I need to do and then work the rest of the time. But right now I'm gonna like set my cats up, put a giant water out. Um, their food is straight. Um, they have this automatic feeder, and I just completely did their litter box, but I'm going to try to set up my ring camera if I can, and I'll probably move the food in a way where I can see the, um, see them, make sure that they're great, and they have food and all of that. So I'm going to work on my ring camera and that, then I'm going to clean out my fridge. I already did my best to, like, start cleaning it out, but I'm just going to, like, throw away a few, like, this has to go, this has to go, like, and I'm going to put it into a target bag right here um and throw it in the trash i'm not gonna let it like sit in my trash um as well as making sure i don't have any dishes i'm gonna run my dishwasher make sure i don't have any stinky dishes sitting in my sink for that long or like laundry i don't want anything that smells sitting in here for 10 days so um that's my next mission b r b <laughs> okay it is 7 10 and as you know, I'm all packed up. Um, I did get my cats together, um, their food. I put the biggest thing of water I could find. I do have someone coming to check on them. And then I did set up my ring camera inside so that I can make sure to keep an eye on my place, my cats, the food, water, yada, yada, yada. And I'm making some spiral mac and cheese. Um, now I'm just like clearing space on my card my memory like downloading movies music kind of just really getting these last minute together things to be prepared for the flight um but i think i'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here because like all my get ready stuff is over with and then um just gonna start the next vlog with traveling to paris with me so um yeah thank you guys for watching make sure you tune in to see my vlog to paris dubai i'm gonna do how much everything costs i'm gonna unplug most things before i go um i have the dishwasher going right now and yeah that's about it so next time you see me i'll be at the airport I'm going to do paris 
Patty. Alright, thank you guys. Have a good night. Bye.